In this video, I'm going to show you how to add text within Final Cut Pro. So I have a video clip added to my timeline and up in this left corner, instead of being selecting this, I'm going to scroll over to this option, which is the text in generators option. So under titles here, I can open this file up and take a look at all the different titles in here. I can also hover my mouse over any of these titles and preview them. So I can see this is a very basic fade and all I have to do is grab it with the mouse drag it over my timeline and let go. I can also grab either side to extend it really long or to make it shorter. And if I click on this text effect and I'm gonna hover over it like so, I can then look on the far right side and see all of my settings. So starting with the far left, if we click on this, you can choose the fade of the speed in and out um, and all those kinds of settings with that transition. If I click here, I can actually change the text effect. So I can change this to Colin Michael if I want, um, just so it's my name. There we go. If I scroll down, I can change the font, if it's bold, whether I want it centered, you know, all of these, all caps, different things like that. I can make all these adjustments to the text itself. And then if I click this video option, I can actually adjust its position. If you make sure that this box is selected, you can actually drag the text anywhere you want. I can have it lower, left, right, all those different things, which I'd probably want it there. So now when I click play here, the text fades onto the screen and then it'll fade off. Now, if you wanna get fancy with text effects, but not have to do a lot of work, what a lot of YouTubers like to do is use software like Envato Elements, which allows you to just use pre-made templates already very well designed and look super professional, but you can just drag and drop into your timeline. I'll have a link down below if you're interested in getting this software, but I have something like these modern titles. I can literally just drag and drop them into the timeline, just like any other text effect. But when I click play, it has a lot cooler animations to them. So I can still drag these and put them in the corner, but just these really cool animations that you can use or if there's this other one down here, that's really cool. So I could do something like this and I'll do a really cool design like that. And it's like no work. I can still click on this. I can still go over and change the text here. I can move it around to make it look cool. And it's so much less work and looks really great. But either way you go, that's the two ways you can add text to your Final Cut Pro videos. I'll have more cool effects you can do within Final Cut Pro in this playlist. So click on there to make sure you're learning all the best ways to edit within Final Cut Pro. So hope to see you over there. Thanks for watching this video.